Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. Today is a very highly requested video. I have been getting asked to do a video like this so many times so finally I have gathered up my information throughout my time of using shapewear or working with my fupa aka pouch. Pouch gang was up. I'm gonna show you guys or just talk to you guys about uh, how I have been working with my fupa and what I do to hide it and also embrace it because it's part of us. Mine has been with me for a very, uh, you know, long run, 10 years. Um, it decided to join me when I got pregnant, had my baby, had Valerie, so here we are still, 2019, still, still, still rocking with me. <laughs> Longest relationship of my life. But anyways, today I'm gonna show you guys things that I have done, shapewear that I wear or have worn to help, you know, hide my fupa or, uh, make me feel more confident and I'm with it nowadays. I just want to mention you don't need shapewear guys All you know, sometimes all it does is just learning to love yourself and just accepting yourself for who you are What body you have and then just rocking with it nowadays? I don't it's it's very rare the occasion that I wear shapewear It's it's with me and ain't nothing gonna change, you know losing weight will get rid of it But honestly low-key I'd love to transfer this 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 front fat to the back so that'll be another video let's just talk about it let's get into it so when I wear dresses like if I'm gonna go out uh, I like to wear dress shaper that's gonna especially if I'm not wearing a dark dress if I'm wearing a light dress as I'm gonna show you guys in a clip as well so I can show you guys like kind of like the difference of what it looks like when you wear shapewear and when you don't so to help hide my fupa a little bit you can't get rid of it guys I'm gonna tell you that right now you can't get rid of it it's gonna be there I haven't came across something that's comfortable because comfortability is more important to me than walking around in something that it's extremely un uncomfortable just to hide my pouch like to me that's just no it, it's just a high level of anxiety up the roof I rather just embrace it than feel miserable the entire time I'm out so anyways uh for shapewear in dresses I like to wear and I've worn this one hold up let me reach for it but it's a smooth shapewear you can get them at Target all of my shapewear I have got it at Target and Lane Bryant but this is the one that I like to wear. I've had these for years, guys, years and years. I used to wear shapewear day and night, okay? This one's the Love You by Assets by Sarah Blakey. And since it's extra large, I would recommend you guys to size down. If you're an XXL, I would recommend you to size down in shapewear just so it could uh, kind of like squeeze you and smooth you out rather than you feel feeling like you're wearing like something on top that's loose uh, just so it could kind of like hug you and smoothen out your curves but this is what it looks like the length of it this one I got at Target Target sells some bomb shapewear guys bomb and comfortable okay I think that's really important to feel comfortable in shapewear because feeling uncomfortable in shapewear and insecure as well is just a bad combo so just make sure that you feel comfortable in shapewear but this is what it looks like i love how it has like an hourglass shape and so then that means that when you wear it it's really gonna pop out that waist and also as well what i like to do when i wear shapewear is wear a bra that's gonna lift up your boobs and really you're gonna see your waist come through especially because shapewear is gonna shape you up help you get that little nice hourglass form um I really recommend you guys to get one, like a silky one, not something that's gonna, a silky because you don't want your dress to raise up. So just just a little advice, a little recommendation. Um, if you guys are gonna wear leggings and you guys wanna wear something compressed, I like to also wear these. Hold on, let me reach, okay? Um, I'm sorry if these look gross, I promise that they are washed, but these have stuck with me for years and years and years. I haven't even seen, um, Target sell these anymore uh, but if you guys could find them great it's a matte material that means that it's not gonna raise up obviously it has a hole in in the bottom but for me I never trusted it so it was always when I would wear shapewear it was always that gotta take everything off and put it back on so if you guys are willing to deal with that I dealt that with that for years but um, throughout my journey of learning how to love myself Shapewear was my closest friend, my bestest friend, and I I am so grateful and I'm glad that shapewear exists because for a lot of us, it has helped us throughout our journeys, throughout finding confidence, you know? A little something I'd like to throw in there. But this 
this I have the I have it in a black you want to have it in a black and you want to have it in a nude so if you guys you know just depending on the color of outfit you're wearing you don't want it to be see-through or if it's see-through you just don't want it to show okay unless you don't care I ended up not caring I didn't care if anybody knew whatever so if you don't care whatever but um so comfortable it's nice and stretchy but it also you know hugs you I I really okay I really recommend you guys to go into Target and actually try their shape work you want to try a shape work that you are going to feel comfortable in. So go physically. Don't order online, guys. Don't order from Instagram. Don't order from all these pop-up sponsored um, or whoever the hell sends you a DM that try my shape or whatever. Don't do it. Don't waste your money, guys. Don't waste your money on a shape unless you know you feel comfortable in it because you don't want to spend all this money and then not feel comfortable or like the shapewear that you are going to be wearing on a daily basis or whenever you wear it, you know? So this one, also from Target, uh, I like to get the shapewears that fit like a bodysuit, meaning it, it's going to go from here. You're going to put your arms in and everything. I don't like the shapewear that only goes up to your waist and then just like that. Not It doesn't work for me because I have back fat rolls right here, then that means that it's going to roll down and when it does roll down, it's going to feel super uncomfortable and it's going to create another roll right here that it that's going to make me feel super uncomfortable. It's going to... I've tried them, guys, before. I've, I've tried them before, guys, and it's just... It's not fun for me, so i just rather deal with the taking it all off and then rolling it back up. There's a lot of chapo hairs right now rolling around. Sorry if you can see that, but I promise I cleaned my place. I just don't know what's going on. You know what's going on? These have been collecting dust. <laughs> because I haven't worn them in a long time. Love them, still gonna keep them. Yeah, I don't like wearing those ones that you pull up, like underwear, but they go super high-waisted because it, they're gonna roll down for me. They don't work for my body, especially because I have back fat rolls. They don't work, I absolutely hate that type of shapewear. And also, I don't like the type of shapewear that's kind of like bikini because of my pouch. Those don't work for me either. It just ends up feeling super uncomfortable and it makes me feel more insecure at the end of the day. Or if I look in the mirror and I'm like, dude, like what the heck? For me, that type of shapewear, that's like kind of like bikini from the bottom. Uh, even though I would try the pull up ones and once I go all the way up, it just, it feels like it brings up my fupa even higher and instead of just like kind of like smoothing it out which is what I like about these that this is like the short type of shapewear it would just kind of like bring it back more up and make me look pregnant honestly honestly you already look pregnant now I don't want to look nine months pregnant okay um I'd rather look two three months pregnant okay so that shapewear definitely doesn't work for me also I have this shapewear that's from Elaine Bryant, which is also silky. This one's like a matte material, so nothing's going to roll up or roll down with this one. I have another one by Elaine Bryant that is like silky, also goes down like this, like shorts or kind of like biker shorts. Also works very well if you guys want to wear a dress, like a longer dress. Um, if like the first one that I showed you rolls up on you, you guys might want to, you know, look into a like biker short long or shorts long one of these shapewear. But these are just ways that I have worked to work with my fupa and my pouch and my uh, belly in the works of being, you know, finding my confidence and stuff like that. You don't need it. You know, I like to mention that you don't need it, but I totally understand and get where everybody's coming from when they're like, hey, Claudia, what do you do to like hide your, your pouch? Or like, you know, what kind of shapewear do you wear? I totally get it. I've been there. I've worn for years and years shapewear from day to night. Um, I know, I know how it is. I know how it is, guys, but trust me, shapewear really really saved me in my you know feeling confident about myself and my body throughout my journey of finding my self-confidence love embracing my body etc now um also what works for me right now that i don't wear shapewear so you guys don't want to wear shapewear and you guys just want to know what you guys could do to you know like hide your fupa a little bit is what i like to do is i like to wear fitted leggings and wearing fitted leggings for me really helps me because it brings out my waist it holds everything together it holds us compression especially when i'm at the gym doing cardio you know like a, a person like me i don't like to to jiggle when i'm doing cardio i don't like to move like you know flapping around even people who have loose skin who have lost the weight you know still wear wearing shapewear really helps because it keeps everything intact so if i'm going to do cardio i might throw in one of my shapewear my bodysuit shapewear 
uh, because I'm going to be doing that cardio and I don't want to be jiggling around everything everywhere. It does hurt. On, like if you guys run and you guys have like that extra skin or extra body fat that jiggles, it does hurt. And it feels uncomfortable, honestly. So sometimes my shapewear does come in handy uh, to do cardio or work out at the gym. But high-waisted fitted leggings is my jam and I love. You guys have seen videos, girl leggings. They roll up nice and high-waisted high-waisted and fitted kind of like already working as a shapewear to kind of like smoothen up your curves and stuff those types of leggings are my jam i don't like to be in leggings that are loose um i do own some nike leggings that i have that feel loose and i hate wearing them i never wear them but my girl leggings or other leggings that are nice and fitted forever 21 leggings as long as they are super high-waisted and they hug my curves i'm good that can also help you as well but yeah guys, that was just like a little short video on things that you can do to hide your fupa or uh, make you feel better embracing your fupa. Also, what I like to do when I wear high-waisted leggings is I like to wear sh shirts that go over, I don't know if you guys can see right now, but like they go over my, my the front like that and like that. So if you guys see me on Instagram, I'm sure that you guys notice a lot that I like to bring my shirts out like this. Kind of like that. I don't know if that makes sense, but it, it kind of like brings like a, a shirt flap right here. So kind of like it brings my hips out and it hides my fupa more. But um, you know, like j learn to embrace your curves, girl, because you are beautiful the way you are. Okay, but if you want to wear shapewear, then rock your shapewear. But just know that you are beautiful just the way you are. Uh, your body is a one, girl, and if ain't nobody else appreciating it, who cares? Who cares? Okay. Uh, learn to embrace your body and wear whatever you want that's going to make you feel comfortable and work with you on your way to your journey and yeah who cares what anybody else thinks okay i hope that this video was helpful i hope that you guys uh check out some pieces at target this is not a sponsored video but all of these pieces are from target um but yeah remember going to a store it doesn't have to be target it can be whatever store lane bryant i don't know if Tori sells shapewear i'm not sure walmart whatever it is Go and try it out physically. <sighs> That's what I recommend you to do because not all shapewear is for you and your body. So go into a store physically, try it on. If it feels good, you know, put it over your with, with your clothes, try it on, sit, roll with it, do whatever you gotta do to see if it feels comfortable. And yeah, that's how that's the best way for you guys to find your type of shapewear. But yeah, guys, anyways, I love you guys so much and keep bringing me them ideas, guys. Um, I love making videos like this for you. I hope that you found this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I have a giveaway coming soon, so you might want to be in tune for that. So yeah, guys, love you guys so much, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.